Collaborate tab and click on the Shared Views. This will load up a Shared Views panel. Now, this panel can be docked and placed on a different screen or just kept alongside the other tabs inside of Inventor. So from here we can see any shared views that we've already created and we can create our own shared view from Inventor. So I'm going to click create new shared view. You can give it a name that's different to the current assembly or part name and you have options to hide component names or part properties. So while this is processed I'm going to explain a little bit more about these shared views. The shared view is a lightweight CAD viewable that you can view online. It's protecting your intellectual property so you're not actually giving out any manufacturing information. Once our model is uploaded, we can choose to copy the link which we could put into an email to send to someone for approval, or we can view this in the browser, on a tablet or on a phone. And obviously, in all of these areas, we get the same functionality that we get inside of the web browser. We can also share drawings. So let's have a look at our shared view inside of this browser over here. We're also able to do things like measurements so we can measure between parts of our model to understand the size of things. So if we look at a markup, maybe we want to zoom into a specific area. I can create a markup and what that does is it takes a screenshot of the current area and I can go to a specific piece of the model and I can then add in a comment. Once I'm happy with that comment, I can save it. And that comment is now uploaded to the shared view. So if I go back into Inventor and I was the design engineer here, and refreshed up, you would see that there's a comment that comment is shown on the model. We can close that markup and because I originated this I could resolve that markup as well. You see that that is now resolved. So the last couple of things you need to remember is that shared views only last 30 days. They can be extended by clicking on the three dots over there and clicking extend and that will extend the shared view for a further 30 days. And remember that you need to be signed into Inventor. And the reason for this is that shared views use part of your A360 allocation. I hope you find this useful.